Oh my god. Look how cute Rivulet is. I love Rivulet. They have bubble. And they swim. It does say, though, you'll be pitted in a world of increasingly frequent floods where time is of the essence. So that sounds kind of, uh, kind of scary. But you get to play a silly water cat, and I love them, and I want to play as them. Uh, what is going on up here? <laughs> Very interesting. Oh my god, I'm so fast. I jump so high. This is crazy. I'm not going to be able to play other cats after this. They're so agile. It's crazy. Look at this. Yes, berries count as one. I can eat my veggies. Whoa! How long can I swim underwater for? Very long. I'm not even tired. Holy crap. Okay, this cat is pretty amazing. Anyways, where am I? <laughs> Everything is fast, even climbing poles. And I have a crazy zoom. Look at this! Oh my goodness. Ah! Stop popping me! Stop it! Is it raining? It's raining! Oh no, there's another bug in here. I'm just gonna be on my way. I actually don't know. Oh no, it was there. It was there. You know, sometimes you make mistakes and uh, what you do is you reset the run. You know, I'm sure I'll be fine. I'm, I'm the river, I'm the watery cat. The watery cat can swim. <laughs> Underwater. Do I never drown? Holy crap, you live so long in water. That's insane. Anyways, reset. <laughs> I love being this fast. But also, like, this, the days are so short. Aw, oh, they have a cute sleep. It's raining today, and I don't really care that much because I can deal with it. Yeet! I love that this cat can just jump across that gap. Whoa, the wall jumps! Oh my god. Okay, this is the cat to watch a speedrun of. Holy crap. Uh, karma system. Normal karma system. Pretty cringe. I want to just drag scabbies around. Speaking of scabbies, hello. Why are you already mad at me? What did I do? We can't be friends this time? We can't be friends? At least we can all agree that Artificer was morally correct with killing all the, the scavengers. Okay, I'm just gonna like... Oh, okay, why are y'all here? I was like... Oh, I'm glad I won't have to deal with as much scavies anymore. Now that I'm playing Rivulet, apparently I was wrong. Oh my god! That's the first time I've done a flip jump. <laughs> okay. Oh shit, it's gonna start raining. That is by far the most buffed thing I have. There's a den on the other side of this, right? Alright, chat. <laughs> There's gonna be a den right as soon as I get to the left here. That's not gonna flood the gate, is it? Yeah, this is a cat. It'd be very nice to not have the intense screen shake during this, because you can actually get to a den's while it's raining. I was so close! You gotta be kidding me! Can you rest while... I wonder if you could rest during this. Maybe it may be the last, because it evolved to, like, deal with the rain. That's interesting. It did mention that. It, like, evolved. This is the highest evolved slug cat. That makes sense, too, because I'm, like, super agile. This is the prime slug cat right here. Hey, we're Axo friends. You're gonna not attack me, right? Because we're friends. We're Axos. Axo gang. Axo gang. I, d I just flipped over them. You realize, though, this would also imply that if this is in the future, the rain gets even worse. And the days get shorter. That's not good. But I guess that's kind of to be expected, honestly. Wait, can I not eat purple? 
I don't like lizards. I don't like eating lizards. They're yucky. Why is there a flying centipede here? At least there's no red lizard. Don't need a spear throw, can just jump up easily. I'm liking Rivulet so far. They're just fun to play as. Wait. It's not garbagey. I have my little my little zone where I'm not getting rained on. My umbrella. You'll never catch me, bird. I'm way too fast. I feel like I'm getting around the map so quickly. <laughs> Can you not? I'm trying to eat poppy corn. No! Oh, you dropped me. Where am I right now? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Alright. Poppy corn restored. Hey, y'all. It's me, the cutest slug cat. You could... You could never harm such a little little cat. What are y'all doing? Fine, I'll just go. You all left. <laughs> I don't know. They all just dipped. Okay. I was so cute. They didn't even feel the need to protect this region. They're like, no, this cat could never do any harm. They've paid the toll by just showing their adorable face. Thank you. Yeah, garbage waste was destroyed. But the water was like clearer, I felt like. What did I just pick up? I got a bubble. Wait a sec. I can create bubbles with my hands. I'm so powerful. All I have to do is hold the bubble plants and they turn into food. I don't need the water. I am the water. Wait, why is shoreline green? Is shoreline normally green here? It's kind of like dirty here. Where'd that lizard come from? Ah! Ah! You know what I can do with this cat? Is I can explore underwater very easily. Apparently so can the lizard though. I feel like this is the easiest cat I've played since Monk. So far. It's raining, it's pouring. The worm took my spear. That's how that song goes, right? You dick! What the hell? I did need that spear. I immediately got grabbed by plant. That killed me?! So much for being a water cat. Okay, that was so. That rain was so strong, it just killed me. Well, I can swim. Oh, look who else can swim. It's our good friend, the Leviathan. That's actually two friend Leviathans. There's two of them. Um, I just got numbed. Okay, this is what happens when I call the, uh, the game easy. Damn it. I thought my agile jumping would get me across. Who the heck are you? That's the weird thing. That's the water centipede. I saw one of those earlier. You have a- oh, you're, you're jamming out there, green lizard? I like your song. But I'm gonna have to- ah! Gonna have to pass on the dance party. This is just... This is a weird room. It's normally here. Where am I going? Um... I don't know where I am. Is this normally in the game? I've never been down here. Oh my god. There's a centipede there. There's a centipede here. Ah!
I'm gonna drown. Well, this place is freaking cursed, but there's more down here. Holy shit. Okay, I just stumbled upon this randomly. Um, I need to remember where this is. I kind of want to just check moon and like come back. Let me skip it on water. Oh my goodness, hello. Nice to see you, buddy. Fellow water creature. You're not going to jump out of the water and try and eat me, are you? You would never do that. I, I'm safe up here. Yeah, get out of here. Go eat some other slug cat. Actually, don't eat any slug cats at all. That would be mean. Go eat like a centipede. They're jerks. I should stop doing like a meme because the time's gonna run out. I can probably find some jank shortcut here. Come on. Yeah! <laughs> moon, moon, moon. How you doing? You're, you're alive, right? You're fine. You're gonna be here. Nothing horrible happened or something. Yay, you're fine. Oh, you can talk to me already. What? You can already talk to me. My memory does not serve me well, but it's been a long time since I encountered one of your species. And none quite with adapt adaptations such as your own. It appears you can breathe underwater. Amazing. Yes, I am amazing. Thank you. Oh, it's because I already have the square. I didn't even notice. More importantly, I wonder who it is that gave you that mark. It could not have been my neighbor Five Pebbles, as he has been sick for a very long time. His frequent downpours suggest to me an acute failure in his machinery. And in that condition, I doubt any creature could get anywhere near him and still make it back alive. Should I not go there then? <laughs> then are you from a faraway land? Did you meet no significant harassment? Or perhaps chasing wind? Or even further than that? These are other iterators. I don't know why you've traveled all this way, but there's nothing for you here. I only advise you to return to wherever you've come from. These lands have become a tremendous hazard, and conditions will only worsen with the passage of time. I hope you understand, my little friend. I don't mean to be discourteous. I'm simply fearing for your safety. Thank you, Moon. But I'm gonna climb up to pebbles anyways. Oh, I have a I have a green I have a green thing. Pearl. It's a very rare find, Water Dancer. It's a highly compressed schematic of an iterator superstructure. Where'd you find this? I hope you didn't plan to give this to the scavengers. I doubt they would value it as much as I would. Seems this may have been a maintenance order, as one of the linear power rails is highlighted in the diagram. The detailed patch of approach outlined. The layout is unfamiliar to me. It's quite different from what I remember of my own structure. It looks as if it's using the newer lymphatic conduit water distribution system. Only the much later models had these. The only one near here would be Five Pebbles. I wonder how he's doing. It's been a very long time since we were last in contact. Thank you for showing this to me, little creature. So you're telling me it's dangerous and impossible to get to Pebbles, but this mysterious pearl I have is related to Pebbles. Guess we gotta go that way. I kinda wanna go back and check that weird underwater place. Okay, we're going in, chat. We're going in. Interestingly enough, it looks like Pebbles is down here. Why is Pebbles down here? Where am I? Where am I? I'm scared. Whoa, this gate's kind of broken a bit. Chat, this isn't Five Pebbles, is it? Did Five Pebbles crash down? into shoreline? There's no way. It feels very iterator-ish. <laughs> Iterator-esque. I'm, I'm still surprised. Like, there keeps being new areas. I'm surprised I'm still finding new areas this far into the DLC. It feels like every slug cat has their own area. There's a chance this is like a piece of Moon's superstructure or something. Like, if we compare the space in Looks to the Moon to Pebbles' space, Pebbles has way more space. So maybe we never uncovered all of it. Alright, well, we had that one time it rained and I was underwater for, like, a very long time. So I'm not too worried about drowning. 
Oh, I'm worried about lizard though. Hello. Um, well, hello. That's a big jellyfish. I didn't even see that. Hello. That was the kind of spooky noise you made there. Are you gonna zap me? You kind of reached towards me. Like, that's. I don't like that. I hear scary noises. Is it raining? Is that gonna even affect me down here? I'm so deep underwater. Who cares if it rains, right? Oh no, this was happening somewhere else too. The green zappies. I just wanted to get to a den, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to find one. What happened? I apparently died off screen. I don't know what happened. <laughs> Maybe it's too zappy in here. Ah! That was a pretty big fall. Oh, that's a centipede. How is it raining here? It's underwater. Wait, what? I'm alive. But where am I? Look at the map. Oh my gosh. I made it. Okay, well this place is much nicer. I want to stay here in this tunnel. This looks a lot like Moon. Moon's area. I'll be honest, I don't even know if I'm supposed to be in here. But this place is kind of awful. Instead of killing you, it just makes it unplayable. And awful to look at. It definitely feels like I'm not supposed to be here yet. Let me do one more attempt on the tunnel, but I'm probably going to pass it. I'm just curious. I like really trying to explore and look around. Why is there like a heartbeat in here? Doesn't it sound like there's a heartbeat? Wait! No! <laughs> Chat, it looped! It did loop! We made it all the way through and it looped. It really feels like there's nowhere to even go here. And I'm sure I'm wrong. I think we should probably head to Pebbles now. This area is called Vents. I don't know, Slugcat. You've been acting pretty sus lately. Among us, but with all slug cats. All the different slug cat types. It was rivulet. I saw them vent. But we all can vent. Artificer. Maybe it was you. You seem to have a strong bloodlust. That's coming from you, Hunter. Alright, alright, everyone. Calm down. Of course nobody would suspect you, monk. Okay, I'll stop. Alright, so, uh, cool place. Uh, but I'm out. Alright, here's the plan, chat. I say we go to the spooky area, and then we head up the right side to the pebbles. Oh, there we go. Fleep. Why is there blue here? There's not supposed to be blue here. <laughs> Are getting eaten by the blue? You guys are idiots. <laughs> They're all gonna die! They all just walked into it. Wow, some lizard gang you are. Okay, what the hell is this? There's a spider, yep. There's a spider, the tunnels are underwater, and the entire surface is blue. Very fun. Hello everyone. I'm just going to be on my way, I guess. Honestly, this place is a lot calmer than usual. Without the birds, they just don't seem to be here. Yeah, I'm kind of worried that the further we get here, the closer we get to pebbles, the more blue it's going to get. Let go of me, buggy! Buggy. Buggy. Actually, kind of... kind of want a buggy. I can't explodey jump, so it's kind of useful. Oh, hello. I was just gonna say, I haven't seen a lot of them. Like, it hasn't been that bad currently. Yeah, they just like fell. Uh, see ya. Have a good time down there. You'll never catch up to Quick Cat the Swift. Oh, looks like it's gonna be a great day out today. Oh boy. 
Is that gonna kill me? Can I not stand on the ground when it's doing that? I'm assuming it's a random chance, like, weather thing. This seems to only happen when it rains. Like, when it rains, the superstructures just get all zappy. No! <laughs> You're kidding me! No! <laughs> Buggy, why? Buggy swung me up too high. I touched the ceiling. Good. Oh, what the hell is this? Okay, they're climbable, that's good to know. That was off screen, dude! Chat. I thought you could grab these. What the frick? God, I hate this area. Dude, what is this? You're kidding me with this. This isn't normally what you have to do. What the shit? This is some kind of joke. I hate this. Why are you in this tunnel? My god. You can't just put this guy in here, where the shelter is. That's what we like to call a scam. Yes! Yes! Yeah, this place might be a bit more destroyed than usual. We've had, like, hints that that might be the case. No. No. Uh, you want to, like, turn on the gravity real quick? That'd be great. Thank you. I'm glowy now! Woo! Is that purple? Is that a purple spider? Uh-oh. Uh-oh! <laughs> I don't want to go see purple. It's like a horror movie right now where it, the monster is slightly off screen and you never get to see it. Okay, it just looks like a normal spider, but it's... Do you see how long this thing's legs are? That's longer than usual. Yeah, this place is messed up right now. I don't think this used to be nearly this destroyed. It's like a wreck. They're slug cat zappers. But we're too smart to fall for that. A slug cat would never get zapped. Luckily, uh, I don't have to worry about time, which is very nice, because that's kind of been the main struggle with this character. Take this slowly. Oh my god. This room is fucked. I have to go all the way back. I have to go all the way back. I, t I didn't find a single den the whole time. I like how the two things this slug cat does is like go fast and be agile and swim through the most cursed areas you've ever seen in your life. Oh my god, but I don't have food. I need a food. Can I have one? Can I have one food? <gasps> no, that's an arm. That's gonna eat me. This is like, this is like when you dangle the like you have the food, the burger on, like, the string. What the hell? What is this? Oh. I got it. No! No! Dude, you're kidding me! Okay, I got out. That was pure panic right there. That was genuine, like, despair in my voice. Oh my god! Your arms are so long. Jeez, like, okay, I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> oh, this is much nicer. This is so much nicer. It's really not. We're just gonna climb these creepy blue vines that, you know, the other blue vines eat me. But these ones are okay. I really don't trust these things. I feel like they're going to eat me. 
See that they're dangling the food in front of me like bait. <laughs> Little guys experiencing cosmic horrors. My favorite genre of game. And also I started... That's a cliff! <laughs> uh, I started with the ability to learn to like understand iterators. So I've already been imbued with like knowledge by uh, some iterator other than Pebbles. We're not sure who it is though. It's clearly the totally real uh, and not name I just made up right now, uh, iterator, partially supplemented bean. Oh, lovely room you got here. Love the interior decorating. Very uh, unique. Ah. I've like fallen out of, oh my God. What? <laughs> what just happened? Why did an arm just reach across the entire map at me? Is that gonna kill me if I fall? I don't think so. Surely that's where you have to go. Okay, that's not solid. That was part of what was confusing me. All right. There's no way this is a cliff. If this is a cliff... Ah! Why is it zappy here? Oh my goodness. Am I gonna get zapped? I'm worried I'm gonna get zapped. Okay, let's let's try and get some uh tasty neurons. Oh, that's not a neuron. Tasty neuron. Okay, we got food. Now will this asshole leave me alone for a second? Uh I'm going to end up hurtling towards it at max speed. You should go to the right. The right, there's tasty things over there. What are you doing? Oh my goodness. <laughs> at least we're not on a, a time crunch right now. What do I even do? Ah! Got him! Oh! Go, 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 go! Go, 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 go! <laughs> go! Go! That took like 10 minutes. Why is there blue right here? Like, I'm gonna pop out and it's gonna eat me. I told you, I knew it! What the shit, dude? What do you do about that? What do you mean? There has to be another way. What if I fleep in this low gravity? I'm gonna reach the top left. Fleep! Oh my god, that was the greatest fleep of all time. Wait, this way? Oh my god, this is just Pebbles' thing. It's just broken into. This is some kind of joke. Seen your kind many times before. To each I've paid little attention. I've given them direction in my wisdom. I hear you stand, another small beast on the floor of my chamber. Your chamber's not looking so good. Nothing to offer you that you don't already have. Nor am I in a state capable of doing so. I cannot help you, I cannot even help myself. Always that same blank expression. Familiarity is a comfort, I suppose. Through whatever chittering or foolish dances your kind uses to communicate my existence. It's clear all of you are quite tenacious. To make the pilgrimage to me is no easy task. Even more so through my structure in its current state. Yeah, it sucked. I can offer no gifts, nor can I be saved or forgiven for what I've done. If you or your kind choose to meddle in the affairs of passing gods, then I'll give you my only request. Deep within the core of the structure is an energy rail that distributes incredible power. This power is drawn from a mass rarefaction cell. Even in my state, a single cell should be enough to help. I ask you this, remove the cell from its chamber and bring it far to the east, to a friend, if she is somehow still alive. Aww. Wait, you're actually, you actually want to help Moon? Once the cell has been removed, my structure will begin shutting down. The pumps that allowed me to flush the decay from my conduits will stop, and I will slowly die. 
Do not run away from my mistakes forever. There's nothing else that can be done now. Please do this for me. You want me to grab this? That pearl is an old keepsake from times long past. It encodes a recording of a short hymn that was popular among the inhabitants of my city. It's a small comfort that helps drown out the solemn ambience of the surrounding facility and best gives some remembrances of better times. It's not much, but I don't have a lot to occupy my time with anymore. Wait, you cannot leave with that. <laughs> okay, I won't. To find the power cell. So that's in here then. I shouldn't be. I shouldn't go this way because this is the way out. I need to like search for it in here. I have to go back to Pebbles again, don't I? Okay. We've at least saved the fact that I talked to Pebbles now. <laughs> now we can go looking for the thing. I'm gonna go this way first. Oh, and you're actually over here, so maybe that's right. Ah! Okay, that was the worst timing of all time. Oh my god, I got grabbed. Okay. We're fine somehow. Oh yeah, cool den, dude. Cool den. What are you even looking at? What do you mean? Wait, what? Oh shit. You can go through here. I don't know, dude. Doesn't look like there's a den here to me. Secret tunnel? That's not a secret tunnel, that's a blue. How did it reach me from across the map, dude? Frick you. Okay, this area sucks. Don't go this way. Peppies wants me to frickin' go to the worst places. That's a very big zappy. Den. I like how when I stop listening to uh, the overseer telling me where the den is, I find the den. Wait, you're telling me something. There's a Pokeball over there. Yeah, I really, I... The Overseer doesn't help a whole lot. That's kind of what they usually do, but I genuinely have no idea which is the correct path. We're just gonna have to wander around until we find something. You're telling me there's a den in both directions. Tell me where the Pokeball is. This loops again. This is insanity, dude. How am I supposed to find some random place in the middle of this maze? It all loops back to itself. Oh, and now you tell me to go this way. When I was trying to go this way, and you were telling me to go, like, the wrong way. I don't even know how to get to the left of this room. I think I need gravity to be off. If I can time this right, maybe I can jump, and then it, gravity will kick in, and then I can, like, float up to the left. Frick, I went directly back into the center. Oh, <laughs> there we go. So somewhere over here, maybe. Whoa! I went flying. Yeah, this might take the cake from my least favorite area ever. <laughs> In terms of navigating it. Jeez. We made it here. No! Dude, how does that happen? No! <laughs> no, what? That got me, dude? No, you didn't. No, you didn't. Oh, I hate this area so much. I hate it so much. It's so bad. It's so terrible. It's so awful. You can't go anywhere, dude. It's so bad. There's no way... Is it here? I'm gonna be so mad if it's here. You have no idea. Like, down from here? You're telling me I never went two to the left from the den? And down? Why is there so many freaking dens that are just baits? To just trap you in a horrible location? It's insane to me that 
if it was here the whole time, I could have gotten this like two hours ago, had I just gone the right way. I went literally every other physical possible way. This is exactly where it's leading me to. Oh no. Should I be going up there? Oh. That's very hard to see. Is this the thing? Can I grab it or something? Ah! I got the Pokeball! Charizard! I choose you! Wait, what does this do? Does this give me low gravity? Oh my god, that's actually really cool. Oh wait, is gravity gonna stop flipping now? Oh, this was the thing flipping the gravity in the entire map. So now I have control over it. I can already foresee myself losing this thing somewhere horrible and never getting it back. Whoa, the yeet flip is crazy now. Dude, it was so close this whole time. I'm so sad. How did I not go two screens to the left? It's not even that bad of a path. This path isn't even that bad. There's just some zappies and like two blue floors. Oh my god. Look at the cycle length. The hell? Okay, that's weird. Whoa, this makes me fly underwater. This actually helps me swim. Okay, let's go. Now I just need to head up like three rooms. Then we can get out of this place. Finally. <laughs> Peppies! I got your silly orb. Look, it does a, it does a bloom. Oh, it's not blooming right now. Goodbye, wet mouse. Send my regards. Peace. I almost, that's is that blue on the ceiling that I almost just jumped into? Wet mouse. Good riddance, Pebbles. Your your freaking area sucks. I hate you. <laughs> it's so, it's so absurd how much height you got. Problem is I can't really hold anything else in my hands. This is a two-handing object right now. I'm just really happy to be out of freaking pebbles and the rot. I went through like the five stages of grief in that area. Yeet! Hello. I'm gonna jump over you. I can float too. No! No! <laughs> no, 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 no! <laughs> okay, we need to be careful of that. Also, this place is kind of very gray. This is interesting. The wall is so cloudy and gray right now. All right, that was really that was a nice like walk in the rain. That felt relaxing actually. I needed that. I'm gonna get some poppy corn. Eat some poppy corn in the rain. There's no way I can miss this jump with the gravity thing. <laughs> I'm just gonna flip over. Whoa! Yeah, that's a bit of an easy jump to make. Whoop! I died? What do you mean? Apparently that water killed me. Sir. Oh! The gravity is messing with me. It's making me hang in the air. So the bird can freaking grab me. Can I move, please? Got him. Are you having fun in the rain? Look like you're having fun. See ya, idiot. Really? I threw it off the cliff! I just yeeted it! <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I panicked. I panicked. I'm go. I'll go get it. I I instinctively throw things when I'm panicking. I got I got grabbed by a centipede. I spam B. I wasn't even grabbed by it. It was just like right next to me. No, dude. Are you kidding me? I was trying to grab the pole. 
And then you're just you just have to die because <laughs> it's gone. This is an escort mission, but it's a ball. Hold chat. Don't celebrate yet. Where am I? Huh? <gasps> Where'd it go? It fell. There was literally a platform here. What happened? In the hole. That's not a hole. <gasps> oh my god. It was here. I don't know what happened, chat. I went so high up that I lost sight of myself. And then I like, I didn't know what was going on. Hole in one. <laughs> you can see it on the map. Okay, I'll make sure I... If there's ever a scenario like that again, which I doubt there will be, I will remember that. Yeet. Don't throw rocks at me! There's lizards down there! Dude! Please! Okay, eye bug. Hi, eye bug. You scared me for a sec there. <laughs> I can't throw at you. I'm gonna hit the worms. They're gonna kill me. Get in here. I kind of deserved that. Yeet. Okay, I thought I've learned not to do that by now. At least we're not on cliffs anymore. Okay, here's my strategy. Wait for this to run out. That's not what I wanted to do! <laughs> That was the opposite of what I wanted to do. I was just knocked myself out and like died. Lizard, yes, help me, lizard. Get him. Let's go! Love you, lizard. Yeah, you should fight each other. That's fun. <laughs> okay, Blue lost that fight very quickly. Wait, they escaped. Oh, never mind. I take it back. Good job, Blue. Green Pearl. It's extra rare. Y'all, don't make me steal your spear. I'm trying to get my orb. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I took like five of their spears. They didn't care. <laughs> <laughs> they just let they just let me go anyways. They're just being good guys. Playing, I'm just bouncing this off the wall. Should I be playing around with this like it's a a tennis ball? Am I gonna break this? We. I'm jumping over the water. Yes, I'm bringing the Pokeball Pebbles. I'm going. In fact, we're going to do a uh, a nifty skip here. Good enough. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Moon, I have your orb. Or I don't know, really, if this is yours. The heavy rainfall as of late has begun to recede. What if Pebbles' machinery finally succumbed to the decay? It was an awful shape last I can remember. Even that was a long time ago. Perhaps he finally solved the riddle. For his sake, I almost hope so. That's cool, but I have orb. What is that, little friend? This is a deeply concerning discovery. Do you have any idea what this is? These are known as mass rarefaction cells. They are a type of backup energy source that powered our superstructures in times of maintenance. Construction, void fluid pipe ruptures, and other power failures. In the absence of our creators to replace deteriorating parts, these cells have become one of the major components that allow all of our facilities to remain powered. However, the fact that this cell is currently in my hands can only mean bad things for whoever this originally came from. I sure hope you weren't the one responsible for it being misplaced. I know firsthand the tragedy of losing this power. In the wake of my accident, all of my rarefaction cells were dislodged on impact. 
and washed away in the floodwaters. The silk could be valuable to me, but with my umbilical severed, my overseers running free, and all of my facilities lying deep beneath a large body of water, it would be impossible, an impossible task to deliver this to a functional location. I'll do it. I might be able to find an access shaft in my lower structure nearby, but I have no idea how much is left of it. Please be careful. Oh, I've I've explored that quite a bit actually, Moon, <laughs> already. Now it's time to go in and actually find what I'm looking for. But now I can explore for longer than like one minute at a time. So that's gonna be a lot easier to deal with. So yeah, it seems that like Pebbles is kind of sacrificing himself a bit here to help Moon, which, you know, he's the reason Moon is like this. But it's, I guess, somewhat of a redemption. All right, well now I have longer days and I can do this. Look how much better this is. I basically have like a constant jetfish. I almost just swam right into the centipede. Uh-oh, it ran out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're fine. Damn, there's a lot I didn't find, isn't there? I was never over here at all. Okay, so this... I have been here. And it feels important, but I don't know. I remember it just looping back. So I'm gonna try and explore these tunnels a bit more. I don't know if this is the right choice, but something tells me. That scared me. Jetfish, relax. That like somewhere down here is important. Centipede. Oh, you're coming this way? I don't know how they didn't notice me. Have I not been up here? Oh shit. The heart. Hold on, I need to breathe. Is there air up here? <laughs> no, the bubbles. Air! God damn it. I finally found it. <laughs> And then I just drown. Wait, it's gonna slide into place perfectly. I definitely have a lot more air this time, but I'm still a bit stressed. Oh my gosh, this is the place. This is the place, it's right here. This is it. Do I have to like throw it in? <laughs> or just activate it? There we go. Let's go. Spin me. You're gonna let me get out of here, right? You're gonna you're gonna let me out of here? You're gonna let me out of here? Let me out No. Okay, that's good. That's good, actually. That lets me out. <laughs> Whoa! What is happening? Oh my god. Oh my god. Get me out of here. Oh no. Okay. Yes, flush me out. Flush me out. Okay, we survived. There we am. We made it out. I was worried that uh, Rivulet wasn't going to make it for a sec. So I guess, do I go back to Moon now? Seems to still be going. Oh, that was some acrobatics. Am I kind of like, what's going on with me? Do you see this? That just means it's cold. That's just my breath. Oh. Whoa. Holy shit. How much of this is solid? If I drop down, that's fine, right? Ah, it's not fine! Oh my god, that baited me. <laughs> we survived. But I thought I could walk on that. Wait. 
What? What happened? <laughs> I was up there. <laughs> so this looped all the way back. I think maybe that was the intended way up here. <laughs> now that I think about it, instead of doing the the parkour, is there even a way to get up here? I'm on cycle 68. We're almost on the best cycle. That's a lot of cycles. Like this is by far the most I've ever done in a playthrough. I think. Ah! <laughs> it's fine. I think this keeps going down. But just in case, I'm going in here. I really like the, the big areas that don't have a ton of enemies to deal with. And are just, like, cool to look at. I said not a ton of enemies. Get away from me, lizard. Wait a sec. Was that the... Artie symbol? What the hell is that? On the other side. Is that just a generic lock? Or is that like the city symbol? Oh my god, this is looks to the moon. Oh, this is so cool. Looks to the moon also has this. The like... The karma symbols. We just never were able to see this. So yeah, that, that was moon city, I guess. This looks exactly like the entrance to Pebbles. Except there's one crucial difference. Where's the poppy corn? I want poppy corn. Now we're truly in the wall too. That's a cliff? <laughs> That's a cliff? What do you mean? I thought you were supposed to go down. I thought it was like the wall. <laughs> what do you mean? I guess it's a dead end with food, so you can go back the other way. It's cool to look that way though. It's very interesting. It's just this piece of looks to the moon we never got to see. You can see that it is actually very similar to pebbles. Well, we're getting low gravity, what the hell? Is that because of the thing I gave moon? Oh my gosh, you have like a an entrance. Sleek a little one, did you do this? It feels if pulled out from a deep sleep. I'm still trying to process all of this. It has been so long since I've had connection like this with my structure. This is so wholesome. We helped Moon for once, like, for real. Everything has restarted in maintenance mode. It seems that it has sent out the order for all of my overseers to return. With my umbilical cable broken, I can't operate my structure directly. With them working as messengers, I've been restoring some of my chamber's functionality. With any luck, I should be able to. Oh, and you have a ton of overseers now. Ah, uh, here we go. There's so much here, so much I've forgotten. I'll never be what I once was, but this, I'm sorry. It's hard to piece all of this together. So much has happened in my absence. I only have unread messages and overseer recordings to make sense of what I've missed. Some of these are even from before my collapse. I see a slug cat. Incredible. Slug reset keys, a messenger saving me? Oh my god, a hunter. No significant harassment was never one to give up easy. However, I still don't understand everything else that has happened. It's all just been coincidence. Did others send help as well? So yeah, this is Hunter canonically helps Moon, and we're in the future after that. Then there was five pebbles. He was sick even before I collapsed, and his state must have only deteriorated since. It looks as if he's barely breathing. If there's any part of him left, I wait, it's that bad? We were once good friends, despite everything that has happened. He is probably alone and afraid now. I cannot run away from my mistakes forever. Please understand. Five Pebbles, what have you done? I've been given so much already, and now you've given all you have left. I don't think you have to be that nice to him. It's not matter what happened between us. If he held the same anger he once did, then none of this would be possible. I've been given the chance to make things right, and he knows he deserves to know what he did wasn't pointless. I'm so thankful for everything. Direct broadcast, private force, Big Sister Moon, five pebbles. This is local group senior, Big Sister Moon. Limited functionality has been restored to some of my basic systems. I've regained access to this communications array for the first time since the collapse. Through my overseers, I have also caught up on some of the current events. Including what I've gathered by reading through my messages and equipment manifests. 
I'm already aware of the large extent to which the local infrastructure has deteriorated. I do not know if sending this message will be a futile effort. Even before the collapse, I could not broadcast beyond the extents of the local facility. Is this farms? And so clearly, this force broadcast is addressed to you, Five Pebbles. Is there any chance that I can still reach you, despite the condition we are both in? I need to know. If in any chance this message arrives, please signal back if you can find a way. I know it may be uncomfortable for you to address me after all that has happened. We've both had a long time to think things through. Any anger I may have had has long since faded. I don't hold anything against you. If anything, we're both in a similar dilemmas right now. And as your big sis, you know how protective I am of you. Sorry, Five Pebbles. I'll always be here if you need someone to talk to. Oh my god. That was so good. <laughs> That's a really good ending. Oh my god. I'm gonna die, these little pictures, dude. These pictures always get me. <laughs> no, why is it the funny number though? Why is it the funny number? Why did I have to finish this in 69 cycles? <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, what happens if I load? I'm just doing a sloop. Ruffles, don't fall asleep here, it's not safe. Wait, you named me Ruffles? Such a small, delicate thing you are. And yet you rebooted a giant organic superstructure and brought peace between two godlike entities of which you have no understanding. But why? I don't know if I'll ever understand, but in any case, you're always welcome here. You just booped me! Why'd you boop me? Whoa! I forgot how low gravity it was. 